breaking news now as well. We're going to go to Fairmount now. There was a home invasion that turned deadly there. And 9 News reporter Kendall Harold is live on the scene with what's happening now. Kendall. Hey, good morning, Catherine. We just spoke with a police officer uh, here in Fairmount, and he tells us that the home invasion that turned deadly here was a targeted attack. Two suspects on the loose right now. They say they consider those two men armed and dangerous. However, once again, they're saying this was a targeted incident. Now, this happened right here behind me on Schodinger Avenue. We have some video to show you of what the scene looked like about an hour ago. Still very active investigation going on right now. Now, we're told that uh, two suspects wearing masks entered this home. They shot a dog and then ordered two men on the ground. There was a third person inside the home. They shot that man. He was killed. Police say that that man was dead on arrival. They say the victim here is a white male in his late 20s, but they are not releasing his name or any other information yet. Uh, the suspects then fled the home, and that's when the two other men in the house left the home to call 911. Police did confirm to us that this victim was shot, uh, they believe, once in the stomach. Now, there was also a dog involved in this. We uh, just witnessed a few minutes ago that dog being led out of the home by police in the SPCA. Now we're told that that dog was shot in its back leg, but we did see that he was alive and walking, limping and a little bit covered in blood, in blood but the SPCA believes that that dog will be okay. But right now, police still searching for those two suspects. We'll continue to stay here this morning and bring you the latest information here on 9 News and WCPO.com. Kendall Harold, 9 News, live in Fairmount.